We have been tracking weather this week. A lot of it, many of you have asked, why did a lot of the snow turn into sleet? Well, TID TV's Ross Caruso explains that. Looking at the radar that we saw yesterday across central Ohio, you can see what looked to be a lot of snow falling, but was actually sleet. The reason for this is not an issue with the radar, but actually it was picking up snow in the upper parts of the atmosphere, but it was falling into a warmer layer of air, which caused it to melt and then refreeze with the colder air we had near the surface. This diagram is basically illustrating temperature variables from the surface all the way to parts of the upper atmosphere. Essentially, the red and blue lines represent temperature and dew point. And what we're seeing here is we can see this black line is showing the temperature of freezing. We had a very warm layer of air above the surface, which actually to melt the snowflakes as they fell. And as they fell beneath that warm layer, they were able to refreeze and thus cause some sleet to form. And again, these are some things that can happen not only in the winter months, but in the spring months as well. But a lot of times when we're dealing with warmer air, we're just going to see plain rain. But again, when we're talking about freezing rain, we have very cold ground temperatures, which allows that ice to form as it freezes on contact. And much like what we saw yesterday, we had a very narrow layer of, of warm air, which allowed for those snowflakes to partially melt, then refreeze into that sleet that we saw yesterday. And then, of course, when we're just dealing with plain cold air, there's better chances to see plain snow.